How to make a cafe latte. Hello and welcome to Video Jug. Top UK barista Robert Henry is going to show you how to make the perfect cafe latte. He's using an espresso maker, which is a steam driven machine that's also used to steam milk. Robert recommends making coffee with Arabica beans as they have a more subtle flavour and lower levels of caffeine than other beans. For more information, see Video Jugs Know Your Beans An Introduction to the World of Coffee. Step 1 You will need an espresso maker, a coffee cup, a wide bottomed jug, water, fresh cold milk, ready ground coffee. You can also use coffee beans, but you'll need a grinder to grind them to the consistency of sugar. Step two, heat the water. Different models may vary, but make sure that you pour enough water into the tank of the machine so that the pump pipes are fully submerged. The handle that holds the coffee is called the group handle, and this should be locked into the machine. Turn on the power and the pump to pump water into the boiler. Turn on the boiler to heat the water. The light on the machine will go out when the water is at the correct temperature. Turn off the boiler and press the dosage button to let water flow through the handle for about 10 seconds. This will clean it through and heat it to the same temperature as the water. Step 3. Add the coffee. Your machine should come with a dosing spoon to measure out the coffee. For a single shot of espresso, you will need one spoonful of coffee. 7 grams, and for a double shot, you will need two spoonfuls, 14 grams. Put the correct amount in the filter basket and tap it to create a level surface. Use the tamper provided to compact the coffee. This will ensure the water doesn't flow through it too fast. Step 4. Filter. Lock the group handle into the machine and put a coffee cup underneath. Turn on the dosage button. The coffee should take 14 to 18 seconds to filter through for a single espresso and 20 to 25 seconds for a double. If it's filtering through too fast, add a bit more coffee and compact it more firmly. If you're grinding your own coffee beans, grind them more finely. Step 5. Steam the milk. Milk can be steamed using the steam arm on your coffee machine. Robert recommends using full fat milk to create plenty of froth. Turn the arm on full for 5 seconds before inserting it into the milk as this will clean it through. Insert the arm into a jug of milk so that the tip is just below the surface to ensure you get frothy milk. Turn it back on full and wait for a few moments until the sides of the jug are hot enough to be uncomfortable to the touch. Turn off and take the jug away. Wipe the steam arm and turn it on to clean it through once more. Step 6. Add the milk. Tap the jug on a work surface to remove any large bubbles. Swirl the milk around to create a dense, smooth foam. Shake the jug as you pour the milk on top of the espresso to make sure the froth comes out. Step 7. Café Latte Macchiato This is a variation of a café latte which is served in a glass and, purely for visual reasons, it's made by adding the espresso after the milk. Steam the milk and pour it into a tall glass. Make an espresso in a small jug and carefully pour it into the glass. The espresso will float above the milk so it should be stirred before drinking. Done.